Hello everybody and thank you for joining us today. So wreaths, they're not just for Christmas, they can actually be a perfect accessory for home decor and instantly transform any room. You can use them at weddings, you can use them in church. And using dried flowers, they're long lasting and so on trend at the moment. So today I'm going to be using one of our make your own kits to create a hop wreath. Now this kit includes the dried flowers, which in this case is a bunch of hops, and a dry foam ring. You'll also need a pair of scissors, and you can find all of the ingredients that I'm using here on our website. So visit www.trianglenursery.co.uk where you can purchase everything that you need. So enjoy!
Thank you so much for watching today's really simple demo. I hope it's inspired you to have a go yourselves. You can find all of our DIY kits and flower boxes on our website. That's www.trianglenursery.co.uk and we have a lovely collection of both fresh and flower, dried flower options for you. And as always, I have some top tips for you. So top tip number one, you can hang with twine because the wreath is so lightweight, it's easy to hang. You can put it either on a door or on a wall, or as an alternative suggestion, you could use it as a table center, then perhaps pop a storm lantern or something in the middle. Do though avoid placing near candles. This is my top tip number two. So if you are using a storm lantern, make sure it's an LED candle. So avoid placing near open candles or an open fire because the dried flowers are actually a fire hazard. Okay, and top tip number three, dried flowers are very brittle. So make sure you place the design in a, what I would call safe position. So it's not gonna get knocked into or squashed or, or knocked over. It break really easily. <laughs> and then top tip number four, you could actually make this particular design with fresh hops, then pop it in position and let it dry in situ. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to share and don't forget to like us. And also comment in the box below because we love to hear feedback on what you've thought of our designs. And also don't forget to go to our YouTube channel and subscribe because there's loads more tips, hints and inspirational ideas of designs that you can create for yourself family and friends. All right, we look forward to welcoming you back again very soon. So for now, it's goodbye.